First, I'd like to congratulate everyone on this momentous achievement. We've made it to the finish line. After years of hard work and studying, we're finally getting our degrees. How amazing is that? Next, I'd like to thank Dean Robeson and the College of Agriculture and Life Sciences for the opportunity to speak on behalf of our graduating class. Then I'd also like to thank all the faculty and staff that helped us get through these four or more years. Now, this speech is only a few minutes long, don't worry, but I'd like us to take a moment to reflect on these past several years. For many of us, we've had a lot of ups and downs. As far as ups, I'll never forget how nervously excited I would get before the start of every new semester. Getting new pens and new notebooks, planning out a whole new schedule, settling into a new routine. I'm the type of person who loves learning and enjoys school, so back to school time was always very exciting for me. As far as downs, my dad was really excited to see me graduate college. He passed away from cancer in 2019. I wanted to briefly mention him in my speech today so in some small way he could be here with us. If we think all the way back to our first semester, we may remember the excitement of everything that was new to our lives. Meeting new friends, learning new things, living in a new place and figuring out the SciRide system. Then we can look back at our last year, spent navigating classes online and getting used to a whole new way of learning and operating. This class has had a unique experience with higher education due to the pandemic we've all been living through. There have been unusual and unforeseen challenges associated with the shift to online and hybrid classes. Personally, some lessons I have learned are to make sure I'm on mute before telling my cat to be quiet out loud in front of the whole class, or to make sure the same said cat doesn't step on my space bar in the middle of a recorded lecture, causing my panicked face to pop up on the recording. These are problems no one before us has ever had to deal with. Though we surely have a lot in common, I know that not everyone has had the same college experience. Actually, I'm sure we've all had vastly different experiences. Some of us went to parties or football games while others joined specialized clubs like the knitting club or mariachi, some of us had friends from high school when we came to college, while others were starting completely fresh. Some of us were living on our own for the very first time when coming to college, and others of us were not. Some of us were transfer students or non-traditional students as well. Our diversity is our strength. I have not necessarily had a typical college experience, but I don't know if the typical experience really exists when there are thousands of us living vastly different lives. In the end, I want all of us to be represented because all of us have made it through. We did it, guys. Congratulations on your degrees. I can't wait to see what we as a class do next. With that, I, Lexi O'Brien, bid you good luck and farewell.